Oh, the roller coaster of emotions. One day you're planning a victory lap, basking in the glory of the professional basketball world. And the next, you're suddenly a free agent with more time on your hands than a cat at a dog park. Lonnie Walker 4 must be feeling that sweet sting of irony. Life sure knows how to give a plot twist, huh? Who needs Netflix when you have the NBA for drama? Picture this, Lonnie, sitting at his favorite spot, sipping a smoothie like everything's great, minding his own business, and bam, news hits that he's been waived. Suddenly, I'm imagining a dramatic slow motion scene where time freezes and he drops his smoothie, realizing that maybe next time he should have invested in a good luck charm instead of a smoothie subscription. Classic case of the notification that you wish you could unsee. Now let's talk about the team's decision. I mean, come on. It surely must have been a tough choice. It's like choosing between your last piece of pizza or leaving it for tomorrow. It feels wrong. Yet you just know the moment you let it go, you'll regret it. So was Lonnie the last slice? Pizza or not, you just can't help but wonder who is actually making the choices here. A seasoned general manager or a kid with a magic eight ball? Lonnie Walker fourth comes in as one of the most promising talents and the Celtics decide, hey, let's mix up our lineup. Sounds familiar. Like the time I tried rearranging my sock drawer in hopes of finding a missing sock. Spoiler alert, I found everything except the sock. I mean, can we just leave well enough alone? Changing things up can have serious consequences, especially in basketball where a change of a player feels like throwing a wrench into a well-oiled machine. Now I can't help but imagine the post-waiver meeting where coach Joe Mazzula probably had to ask Lonnie to, oh, you know, kindly pack his bags. The same bags filled with dreams of championship glory. It's like getting a pink slip from your job, but instead of HR, you have the coach giving you the news while everyone else awkwardly shuffles around pretending they're busy. But are they really busy or just pretending to care? So what's next for our friend Lonnie? A pep talk? Keep your chin up, Lonnie. You'll find your way. Maybe start a career as a motivational speaker. Honestly, a reality show's brewing in my mind. Lonnie Walker, The Free Agent Chronicles. Follow him through awkward coffee shop encounters and hopeful tryouts like it's the next big rom-com, complete with cheesy background piano music for the ideal cringe factor. But for real, what do you think Lonnie should do next? Join another team, start a podcast, or maybe take up competitive knitting. The world is his oyster, but that's only if an oyster was an actual NBA career waiting for him to check it out. What's your vote, audience? Where should Lonnie Walker 4 land next in this dramatic saga? Like and subscribe, please.